It was difficult. I think a lot of the aquatics directors in the area kind of faced that, um, but we really took it one day at a time. It has been a tough season for community pools and water parks navigating through a national lifeguard shortage. It got so bad in some areas, pools never even opened or had to cut way back on those hours. The city of Colleen has been faced with staffing shortages throughout the season and is now closing its main water park. 25 News reporter Leah McNeil joins us now from the park. Leah, what's the city's plan moving forward? Well, Todd and Naya, any other swim season on a Friday night, the Colleen Family Aquatic Center would have their gates open, welcoming families from all across the city. But after a season where they were faced with staffing and lifeguard shortages, which forced them to get a late start to the season, they're now closing up a little bit early this year. The sounds of summer are now silent. This has been our shortest season for this park. We got so used to it being loud. It's an eerie sense of calm. It's just very strange for it to be as quiet as it is. Clarice Free Aquatics Manager has been facing challenges from the start. Navigating through the season was tough. I will say we had an incredible group of staff that was really resilient. So they came in, they knew the possibility that our facilities may change, we may open one, close one. Less staffing means an early end to the season that was already operating on limited hours. We didn't have to do as much as like backwashing the pools and stuff like that because we didn't have that many people. So it was a little easier this year than, than last summer. So. But we really took it one day at a time and just did what we could. Like our ultimate goal is always to provide the service to our community. The Aquatic Center locking up. But Long Branch Pool and the splash pad across the street is now open in its place. We live in an apartment complex and so um, I mean, we do have a pool, but it's nice to be able to get together with friends outside. With this season almost behind them, Free is now focused on the future. We're going to try to get a, a bunch of updated stuff. Slides next year will be a little bit faster than they were this year, and some of the spray features will work a little bit better. The park itself is getting some new signs. It's getting some new visions as far as what the theme is and things like that. So just making it a little more pulled together. Now, some community members are really disappointed to see this aquatic center close. Just a few moments ago, I actually had to turn a family of four away, hoping to get a dip in the pool, but I unfortunately had to tell them that it was closed for the season. Now, Clarice Free, the aquatics director, is working on things for the future, already planning ahead and reaching out to some of those local high schools with athletes, as well as planning a junior swimming league to make sure that those students who go through the program can grow into those positions. That way, they won't have to face any staffing shortages in the future. Live in Colleen, Leah McNeil, 25 News.